Greetings, everybody. I am Ellen Koshowski, and guess what? It's garage sale day. Just stopped at a garage sale, actually in my neck of the woods, and they didn't really have anything. I stopped, but every once in a while they'll have a sale, and since they're so close to me, I always, I always check it out. It's an older couple, so it's not like I'm gonna find anything. She thought she had something today, but she showed me blank CDs, which can't use those. And then she showed me Turbo, the Disney movie, on DVD and Blu-ray. And I'm like, that won't help me either. That's more of a Josh thing. But anywho, on to the next stop. I stopped at that pawn shop right there. And I just picked up my first score of the day. I got not one, but dose PS3 controllers. One's a six axis, one's a dual shock, but I'm low on those. So I figured I'd pick those up. They had a Series X game, but they wanted 20 for it. It was Watchdog Legion that I was tinkering with X. I don't think I have that one for at the store. But unfortunately, I I looked on eBay. I can't buy it for that because it's going for like 25 anyway, 2025. 20, we got uh, Renaissance of Fate on 360 Titanfall on Xbox One, South Park Stick of Truth on PS3 and then we have Rocky on the PS2 I picked that one up we got Monster Jam Urban Assault on PS2 we've got Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories on PS2 San Andreas PS2 Halo Wars there are some other games that I was toying with getting when I was in there but the prices on them were just slightly too high and I'm not trying to overspend uh, even though, yes, I, I may or may not have more money than usual, but that's not the point. The point is, I gotta pay what I gotta pay for stuff. You know, if I if I start overpaying just because just because I have a few dollars in my wallet, that defeats the whole purpose, and then the money will go. So I gotta still be I still got still gotta be a thrifty shopper, even though I am now a Robin Hood crypto millionaire. I mean, I'm not a millionaire, but you know what I mean. You know, I got the Robin Hood. Anyway, I'll see you guys at our next stop. Just stopped at Goodwill over there. Did not pick anything up, but um, I did. They, I mean, they have games at Goodwill, but it's been extremely dry. Like it's 90% sport games, um, and the few games that weren't sports were too high for me to pay for. Because Goodwill just tends to price all their games at 3.95 or 4.95, and I can't pay that for a 360 game, you know. But anywho, I will see you guys. At our next stop, there's a couple more pawn shops up on the way, and I got some surprises in store. So the day of finds continues at Cash America. I picked up one copy of NASCAR Heat 4. I picked up those copies of Overwatch. Um, they did $4.99 each on those three, and then this one was a buck. Uh, Overwatch trades it for $7.70. Or I think it was 770 something like that. I traded it for more than what I paid, so I'm like, screw it, I'll just buy it. Um, and then the other one traded in, I want to say, for like six bucks. So, good deals all around. I'm going to go hit up another stop, and I'll see you guys in a second. We're actually making some good finds today, baby. Woo. Just stopped at the reincarnation of Big Tim's Pond. Back in the day, there was a place called Big Tim's Pond. Now this one's called Tim's, Pond, Tim's Trading Post and Pond. Anyway, it's funny because I used to know all the guys back at the other one. It was a long time ago. And I just picked up Wrestling 19. Um, there was a couple, yes, a couple crappy sport games in here. Madden 19, uh, NBA 19. <coughs> yeah, sorry. And then the limited edition Madden 19. If you wonder why I bought, bought those, all four of these were $10. Oh, hold on, someone's calling. Okay, so if you're wondering why I paid $10 for those four games um, that I just showed you a second ago, I don't know if I explained this. This one here trades in for $13.20 in store credit. So this is more than what they're also, even though I, I already have all those and I didn't need re really to buy them. The guy here, he's like, just, just buy them, whatever, just give me a price. You know, so that came out to be $2 each. And the one will trade in for enough to 
I could technically trade that in for cash and get my money back. And that gets him out of He's trying to get rid of all his sport games. Anyway, we picked up Pac-Man World 3. This is complete. That's a $20 on eBay. Uh, this one I bought because I don't think I have any copies. Twisted Metal. I always get people asking me for Twisted Metal. And I never have it. So I bought this one. This was, he did like $3 on it. But that's a solid $10 game. Here's another one that was $3 that is a solid $10, $15 game. Uh, Shadow, the Colossus, and Ico Remastered Collection. Always a good deal for that. This one here was 8 Trades are for like 15 It's the new Dragon Ball Z carrot. Um, Dragon Ball Z stuff is through the roof always because, you know, Goku and whatnot. Here was a $6, but it is Spider-Man. It's not the newest Spider-Man, but it is one of the newer ones. And I, this has a high trade value. I didn't even look it up. But I just I just knew what that was when I saw it. This one here, uh, I paid a little bit for. It was either 10 or 12 I got to go down a little bit. But it is The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. That's a solid 20. All day, every day, twice per Sunday. And the baby of the deal. Now, it says Smash Brothers, but I opened up this case. And it's even better than Smash Brothers. Mario Kart on the Wii. That is like... $59.99 at GameStop right now, stupid high. I'll be able to probably get 40 bucks out of that just because it's Mario Kart. Everybody's wanting it, and I might even have a case for that back at the store. I'll see you guys in a second. Today is the day of fines, baby. Day of fines. Woo. So, so me and Josh, me and Josh just stopped at a garage sale. Mama K, what are you doing at a random garage sale in Pinellas County? Why? Yes, I'm selling mine in Joshua's truck. Watch your money. Wow. Yeah, yeah, we just stopped by a garage oh sale. Gosh. No video games, but they got a Mama K. We're out. Woo! Hey, come. So just picked up. These are all the scores for the day. Titanfall on Xbox One. Renaissance, Resonance of Fate on Xbox 360. We've got Spider-Man on PS4. Zelda on 3DS. Uh, Dragon Ball Z Carrot. We got the two dual shot, well, one's dual shock, one's six axis controller. Pac Man World 3, Fight Night, Rocky, the Smash Brothers. That, in fact, is not Smash Brothers. It is actually Mario Kart on the Wii, which is even better. Uh, Monster Jam, Urban Assault, uh, Grand Theft Auto, Liberty City, San Andreas, Halo Wars, South Park, Stick of Truth, the Ico Shadow of the Colossus Collection on PS3, Twisted Metal on PS3. NASCAR Heat 4 on PS4, not one, but two copies of Overwatch on the PS4, uh, W2K19, NBA 2K19, Madden 2K19, Madden 19, all of that. I probably spent like 80 to 100 bucks on everything. It was a very profitable and successful day out garage selling. So thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for next week's uh, garage sale episode. I'll keep you guys posted. I'm out. Yeah. Yes, um, see, uh, yes, the, the garage sale back there, they didn't have anything. Um, but, uh, funding, I need funding for the business. Okay.